Julie Blanner from the Lifestyle website, julieblanner.com, where I share easy ideas for entertaining recipes, home decor, and so much more. Today, I'm here to share our Lake Cottage Kitchen with you. kitchen that you see on YouTube or on blogs, is it? And what makes it so different is that I have oak cabinets and I haven't painted them. You know why? Because sometimes it's just not practical. It's not worthwhile, it's just too expensive, too time consuming, or you just want to work with what you have, which is exactly where I was at. I just wanted to work with what I had. It doesn't bother me, it's a low priority project, and so I'm going to share with you today how to make oak cabinets work on a budget while still making your space feel much more fresh. Now, when we moved into Calm Water Cottage, one of the first things we did was we painted. Paint does make a lot of difference. So we removed the wallpaper above and around the cabinets, removed all the ivy, and it immediately felt a lot fresher. Now, we were really lucky because we had a porcelain sink already, but we had a very dated fixture. So a faucet, that is a really easy, quick fix to really update your oak cabinets or any kitchen. And then, of course, we added new hardware. Now, you don't want the hardware to look too new, too up-to-date, so I went with something more traditional, like these brass poles and handles. Unfortunately, they're no longer available, but I'll link to some in the description below that are very similar, that will give you that same aesthetic and about the same price. So that is a quick and easy thing to do. I believe that took us about $100 and an hour to update this entire kitchen. Actually, I say it took $100, but we previously used them in our last kitchen with oak cabinets to update those before we gutted that kitchen. Now we're lucky that we have white appliances. They're not ideal, of course they're dated, but they're white. If you don't, there are some other options you can do. If you want to make them look stainless steel, I'll link to my tutorial on how to do that um, below as well. One of the most charming things about our kitchen is this darling little sconce that our builder had put in, installed, and it has a nice silk shade and it's something that I just can't part with. Our builder is a friend of ours and while this home was built over 20 years ago, there are still some elements that are very relevant today because he integrated some timeless style into it as well. And I just thought that was such a charming little feature that we'll always keep it. We decided to really bring it up to date and just make it feel more fresh by adding this basket weave light fixture. Now you can use a light kit to recreate the look or I'll link to this particular fixture in the description below. I also brought in an indoor outdoor rug. Indoor-outdoor rugs are my absolute favorite to use in our home because they're soft to the touch, at least the high quality ones are, and they're so easy to clean. So anytime this gets to be too messy, I just take it outside, hose it off, allow it to dry in the sun, bring it back in, and it's like new, even the white stripes. So that's such a great way to cover up this tile that I don't particularly love but don't hate enough to replace yet. I hope you've enjoyed this tour of our Lake Cottage Kitchen and hope you come back to visit me again soon. Don't forget to click subscribe for more easy ideas for updating your home.